Good morning. Good morning, wild hair. Good morning, wild hair. Hey, baby. Hey, baby. Good morning, wild hair. I know. She always cry for her milk. Even when she knows she's gonna get it. And it's so big for this little poppy lounger. Easiest way to one hand get or something, but look how big she's getting. So tall. They actually have a doctor's appointment this morning at 10.30. Um, I think it's like nine o'clock, so pretty soon I gotta start getting them ready and pat the situated. I always try to have her a little bit kind of like just in a diaper after we get out the car so that it can be quick easy and painless she had an emergency appointment on two days ago um for her wheezing she was wheezing after she eats which i've come to find out that's pretty normal but when we found out about the wheezing we uh noticed some bleeding and i don't know if she just might have bit her gums wrong or anything like that but she has like three teeth coming in so uh, she's kind of going through a lot at the same time. Uh, where's your baba? <laughs> we need to get Nala to the dentist soon because she hasn't been to the dentist yet. And she has all these beautiful teeth that you need to know how your teeth is doing. You really do. So, yeah, outside of that uh oh lord look at look at this girl hold on i'll be trying to have a good system to feed her and to have her next to me 
and her be able to watch TV at the same time. It's hectic, but this is how you gotta do it with two kids who want attention. So, so I'm gonna let them watch a little bit of TV and then start getting them ready for the doctor's appointment. David is at work. He should be off around one o'clock. So, until then, it is us. <sighs> okay, I'll get back to you. No, really. 28 inches. You almost a so big girl. All right, I'll send Dr. Okay? Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. You're a big girl. 28 inches. 28 inches. There she is. It's okay. Having a hard time. Real hard time. What people? And people not being around and the whole COVID thing. Hopefully, we're able to have family around more often. So, it won't be so weird. What are you doing? What are you doing, girl? Okay. Yeah. Ooh. Corona. Yes, the one that's by mouth first. Okay. And then it'll be easiest if you're on that side. Oh, okay, good. Where are you? <laughs> Ooh, she's a kicker. Mm-hmm. She likes Bumble. Does she? Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's see. She, I know it's not Mel. Yeah, she never likes this stuff. No. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's okay, baby. It's okay. This is not meant for this. You did better this time. She did. She did good. Uh oh. I'm sorry. It's cold. I'm sorry. Since you're a kicker, I'm gonna hold you down a little. Just a little. <laughs> She's looking like, arm. yeah. This one. Oh. All right. Now let her go, Mom. Mm -hmm. Talk to her. Sing to her. That's okay. It's okay. <laughs> she's so it's okay, baby. The you last one's gonna okay. stay in the little, yeah. so. It's okay. How you doing? <laughs> oh, no. I'm sorry, I'm oh. sorry, mama. Oh, her little feet. It's okay. It's okay. Ooh, 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 ooh. All right, Mama. Well, you have all the paperwork, all the yes. information. 
transition, so you are all set. See, it's okay. It's okay. See, I cried two times, and that's it. It's always that one. Both of her and now it's always that one. But I'm going to get things situated in the Batmobile. And then we'll be out. Be so <laughs> to the parents whose kids have peed out their diapers, let's give those parents a moment of silence. I feel you. When I get home, I know what I got to do. I gotta change clothes, I swear. Comment down below on how many times you have to wash laundry for your kids. When you comment down below, tell me how many kids you have. How often do, do you wash? Matter of fact, put me up on game on how to get out the yellow milk stains while you at it. But outside of that, because I swear, sometimes we let it pile up because of how many clothes they have. But still, washing clothes is a real thing. That's a job. And whoever said that a stay-at-home mom isn't good enough, that act like a stay-at-home isn't a job, can suck on my middle finger. I'm just saying, because being a stay-at-home mom, I've been at home for pretty much nine months, long as I've ever been without a job. But I swear, this is the hardest job I've ever had because it's never ending. At least when you go to work, you have a break time and you have a lunch time. And that time is to yourself. Oh no, my friends. You gotta squeeze in that time. Imagine if you had a job that you had to figure out how to squeeze in time to eat. Because they don't give it to you. Just just let it resonate. And then you gotta spend your own money. That's crazy. They got a maid. Let me be a kid again and remember. All right, hi you guys. So it has been a couple hours since I last spoke to you guys. I got them out the car, changed and all of them, then put them down to bed, ate, and just been chilling here on the couch with David. David had came home from work. And now it's about 2.15 and I was up. David is taking Nala to the potty now. So while they while he's taking her to the potty, I just wanted to give you an update on that. So so far I've taken her about two other times. Mind you, I was at the doctor's office. But she didn't potty. She hasn't potty in the potty. So I don't know what she's gonna do this time, but I'm really, really hoping for progression. This is only completely day two, so I'm not going to overthink it, over rush it, but yeah. So I'm really hoping that we're able to take her out either to the pool or um, do her water table today. Probably her water table, so pretty soon I think I'm going to go out there and just start to open it and prepare it so that we can um, have a little bit of fun today. She's about to drink a milk. Kitty shows is on right now. One of the kitty shows that we like, especially when it comes to help trying to teach sign language and stuff like that. Um, I'm not very prominent on teaching her, but um, I love this little kid show because it teaches how to communicate and gestures and things like that. Um, okay. on YouTube. Should we come down the slide? Say, yeah. 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 Let's do it. See? Ready? I love that. Yeah. Like, she's very Go. vocal about the yes and no's in sign language yeah. and communication. That's how I discovered her about communicating with preschoolers and stuff like that.
So yeah, check it out. Songs for Littles. That's the name. <coughs> yeah, okay. She didn't pee for me. Mm -hmm. and of course. Mm. It's okay. Still out cold. Yeah, I kind of told him everything, but basically, if you didn't hear, she is 20 inches, 20 pounds, one ounce, and still in the 90 percentile. Um, she's throwing up a lot, but she says it's normal because she's getting more mobile. Who knows? She did suggest to give her more food, and then if I want to give her, but she said cut down on milk to four ounces. I said she drink about five ounces. She just like cut it down to four and she only should be drinking maybe four or five bottles a day. But if you want to give her more milk, just put her milk in her food. Put her milk in her food? Yeah, and do more solid. Hold on, I saw that. You didn't think I saw that, but I saw that. She hit her head. <laughs> <laughs> Now they're up, and I just realized I never recorded, but this is my first time giving her yogurt, which was suggested. So I'm very curious on how this is gonna go. Ooh. Ugh, this is gonna be messy. All she want to do is play in it. Yeah. I might as well would have added food color in and stuff. Okay, that didn't work well. Ooh. It's coming down her side. Oh, look at that pile. Do y'all see that? It's a glob right there. Oh. You see it? Okay, in theory, this was awesome. Okay, I might as well just clean her up at the end. I don't know. Look at this. I don't know what I should do. I should clean this up and then put her back in. Oh wow. Oh wow. It's gonna be one of these days, huh? Alright, so I cleaned it up a little bit, just wiped it down, took like white. And this one is acting like she has attachment issues now because I try to pull her near me and she just wants to pull her back. You is not her mama. You is not her mama. I'm her mama. Look at that. <laughs> Look at the babies. Mama, pick it up. We outside, y'all. We kicking it. We kicking yeah. it. Show her how to do it again. Now we're done. Woo! Come on, let's show them how to do it. Now where you go? No, Ellie, Ellie, look. No, Ellie, yeah. yeah. Look now, look. You going to show it again. Woo! Yeah. Yay! <laughs> you teach how to splash in it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now she's just gonna wet this excess off up, but it's okay. It's okay. Look, she think this is like a cup of juice or something. You trying to eat it? You trying to eat it and bang it? Now we going. We just bought her exercise out here and. Letting her live the best life so it should get this wet. No harm, no foul. I wonder is there a way to actually wash this? 
maybe we just don't know it but we'll just go ahead and let it get wet let it sit out in, in the sun yeah just let it have a good time she uses less than her jumper so more okay daddy got his beer it's essential yeah i just got this juice that i'm probably gonna have nala try to get some juice and she can kind of be messy because it don't matter it be her learning how to drink out a cup thing without messing up our house yeah Whee! she running <laughs> come back in. hi you guys so we're back in the house I have showered and changed. Noelle has changed as well and she is dead sleep. She didn't have time for us. She wasn't playing with us. She needed a nap. So she went to bed like 6.30 roughly. We were trying to keep her up till 7 or 7.30 so that she can actually sleep through the night. But I don't know what to expect. I'm gonna just let her sleep until she wakes up. I'm not going to wake her up or anything like that. We'll figure it out. But we're letting Nala Bala stay up. But I don't even know what time it is now. Uh, it is 7.05. Yeah, so we'll probably let her stay up another 30 minutes or so. I am actually having a big sweet tooth, so I am going to um, Publix. Publix. Yes. To get some snacks and ice cream and all that type stuff and we're just gonna chill out and have us a night watching TV and a good time. Maybe drink a little. Oh, you gonna get some laundry? Little. Some Prosecco? <laughs> he played too much. Yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and do here because I'm ready to wipe this makeup off. I'm ready to like chillax and vibe. Or whatnot but till next time we love you and we'll see you guys in the next one peace